So there is no intro for this part two, but uh, let's touch right away. And the fifth question, how do you pray Tahajud by Omar? When Tahajud? Tahajud, uh, this is a prayer prayed, after, prayed at night. Like when someone, uh, when someone sleeps and then wakes up, wakes up and prays, that Salah is called Tahajud. So, the near is always nawaitu oswali rakataini. Okay, it is prayed in uh, pairs. Okay, the the swala has two rakats. Each swala has two rakats, so it's prayed in pairs. So it's nawaitu oswali rakataini, uh, rakataini swala to tahajjud. Imaman au imaman. Aw ma mu'man lillahi ta'ala Allah So in in case of uh, the the surahs you have to recite some have narrated you recite and fatiha then after fatiha you go to indas and alhamdulillah uh, till qadir but you can recite any surah you want just after fatiha then uh, if you have not memorized uh, you you have not memorized uh, the surahs in the Quran, you can hold your Quran actually and read while praying or if you have your Quran on your phone, you can use it. You can use your phone. Uh, uh, another thing like Qiyamul Layl, I want to explain Qiyamul Layl and Tahajjud. Qiyamul Layl, this is, this, this is a prayer actually. It's also prayed at night, but the difference is for it is when it's uh, it's in Ramadan, the ten day, the ten last days of Ramadan. That's when you pray Qiyamul Layl. That's not the Hajj. That's where the difference is. But everything is same. So the Niyah just changes to Nawaitu Salli Rakataini Salatu Qiyamul Layl Ma'amuman Aw E Salatu Layl Ma'amuman Aw Imaman Lillahi Taala Allah. Thank you. When should one break their fast by Farida? The time? As in Iftar is one of the religious observed names of Ramadan and it is oft, often that as a community with Muslim people gathering to break their fast together. Um, this meal, uh, according to, to me, um, Time changes according to places. So this meal is taken just after the call to the Maghrib prayer, which is around sunset. That's according to me. Yes. Uh, how many sunnas does Duhur have? By Malik. <laughs> what? Uh, according to. Ibn Umar narrated that you can recite, you can pray two Sunara cuts, and then Aisha, prophet his wife, also narrated that you can pray four Sunara cuts before and after, and a person has a choice either pray two or four. 
what is witchery by me then the so guys my second question is uh, what is witchery which is an odd numbered prayer uh, that goes from uh, 1 to 11 uh, it is prayed in pairs like 2 2 2 and the last one is just one just one raka and then salam yeah that's that's witchery and uh, it's a sunnah that you know is prayed like after either taraway uh, or after isha whenever you want but it's at night uh, before before fajr after isha i i read this from somewhere if one fears that he would not be able to wake up uh, or they may die in their sleep for example uh, then this prayer should be performed before sleeping but if you know you pray tahajjud regularly and regularly then you could pray it at, you know like after tahajjud then pray your witchery yeah so there is a hadith i'll tell you so the ones who wanted to memorize hadith here it is uh, it is recorded that Abu Ali ibn Abu Talib said the witchery is not required like your obligatory prayers so that means it's sunnah but the prophet would perform witchery prayer and say all you people of the Quran perform the witchery prayer for Allah for Allah is one and he loves the witchery so just perform it for Allah you know what I mean? Yeah. What do you like and not like about Ramadan? So what do you like, Sebo? What I like about Ramadan is that a person attains blessings. Thank you. Uh -huh. um, a person is being forgiven for his or her sins. Yes. Uh, what I love about Ramadan is that our hearts get, get more closer to Allah than ever before. The Iman is very high. And what I like about Ramadan is the unity, man. We eat together, we do everything together. It is, eating, it of nice. course. Eating, of course. See. And then what don't you like about Ramadan? Uh, it's a <laughs> <laughs> um, Yeah. <laughs> some things and the activities you like most are being forbidden to be done. Yes. Uh -huh. uh, I don't think there's anything which is forbidden for me as in my normal life so mm -hmm. i don't think there's anything i hate about her apart from the sound part because obviously observing the sound it's like sacrificing what something. i don't like about her, the way people's mouths smell <laughs> anyways <laughs> allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves the smell so if your mouth is smelling don't worry allah loves it like that yeah. So continue fasting, yeah. So uh, our next, our last question is, which people are not uh, allowed are allowed not to fast? Um, Pregnant mothers. Uh, girls, girls that are. Uh, in their the years. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Not even months. <laughs> <laughs> and then. Uh, hmm? I'm going to say mm. about young children. Yeah. 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 yeah, those who have yeah. not yet reached the and then angels. those ones who have uh, sickness, chronic diseases. chronic diseases, cannot fast. You know, like those ones who say they have ulcers. 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 I have ulcers, but I fast. Uh, uh, but there are some ulcers that are not <laughs> like yeah, you can fast. But there, there are some that you know you, you can fast, but you still uh, don't fast. You get yeah, that's like, true. What, that's what true. Are you doing? In fact, uh, what, what you should know in the eyes of Allah, whether you're young or old or thin or short or, or what, fat you're, or all, thin. you're all equal in, in the eyes of Allah. So you cannot say that uh, I'll start fasting when I am the eyes of my, my father or my mom. You get, you have to start when you're young because the, your, your accountability starts now. You get, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh. So. Actually, actually, accountability starts when you, when you are, when you are seven years, seven, seven, no, 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 fourteen. Seven. When, 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 no, not fourteen. When you, 
Adolescence. Yes, when you reach the adolescent stage. Yeah. So literally, we have someone here who's not yet there. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. Anyways, uh, he will give us the near to start home, and then I hope you, it helps you. In, like before you start, uh, after having your suhur, you should always say this near to start home. I tell her to open the Ah, so the the near of start home is. Uh, I will be lying Shaitan in Rajim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. I mean. Alhamdulillah. Yes, that's the name of Saum. Uh, May your fasting be the best ever, and I hope you learned something, inshallah. Uh, what else? What should we tell them? Uh, um, have, a, have a blessed month. <laughs> Subscribe, hit the like button, comment, comment down below, share with your friends if you don't like. If 